Hello everybody and ha ha ho! What have we got here? Why? It's a one terabyte PS4 Slim. It's been a while since our last unboxing on this channel, so let's get to it. Just real quick, I'm gonna uh, show you the box. Good. I'm not sure if it has any games included. Yeah. It's got pictures of some on the back, but I doubt they're included. Whoops, and out fall some cords. Well, we got hey, the power cord, we've got some earphones, heard what those for, and uh, USB to micro USB, that's obviously for charging the DualShock 4. And here is the DualShock 4. Oh wow. I think I've touched one of these before. So I hear the pro the um PS4 Slim updated it. I don't have a, a pre-model one to compare it to. However, I will compare it to the DualShock 3. <laughs> Changes are obvious. I mean, this is like the first time since the since the dual analog stick adding on the PS1 that they've actually redesigned this thing. I know, I'm a, I'm like, what, four years late to the PS4 party, but hey. What can I say? It's not my top priority. Alright. Hello? And HDMI cable, that's nice. Manual, that's always important. And here... Oh my goodness, this is heavy. That's it for the box, I guess. This, I believe, is the console itself. I mean, what else would it be? I'm gonna get rid of these bits of cardboard. Why would I need them? You're seeing it here first. Wow. This is neat. Alright, on the back you got the power cord, you got a US actually no, that's not I don't know what that is. It's a LAN adapter and the HDMI. Well as uh, this thing. And that is where the hard drive is stored. Don't have a replacement, so there's no need for that. And just for comparison, here's the PS4 Slim next to my PS3 Super Slim. Despite the size difference, they weigh they weigh kind of equally. Maybe the PS3 a little more. You know, just you can see the there's two USBs on the front. This is where the disk drive is. I am, uh, on the bottom it's got like the rubber grooves that hold it up are like the buttons, that's cool. Alright.